the group that is going to be here in just a moment, minister in song, they carry the most important message in all the world. They sing of Jesus. Would you welcome Andres Blackwood and company. styles for you. We want to sing for you, and I, I might as well admit, we want to entertain you for, to a certain extent, you know, because we want you to laugh and have a great time. Uh, you know, some people think it's wrong for Christians to laugh. I think if anybody should be happy, if anybody should have an abundant life, it's those of us who found the very author of life, Jesus Christ. So we don't apologize for the joy and the peace and the happiness that he's placed in our lives. So we're going to have a, a great time tonight. And also we're going to have worship and praise the Lord Jesus Christ. Because you see, all that goes hand in hand. We're not going to, you know, we're high, multifaceted, I think that's the word. Did I say that right? I think I got stuff all over my clothes, too. But uh, <clears throat> here we go. Never be. Never be another man to walk upon the sea. Never be another man who could die for you and me. Never be. No, never be. Never 
First Peter 5 and 7 said, cast all your cares on him, for he cared for you. And that's what we suggest with this particular song. It's called, Give Them All to Jesus. Are you tired of 
better knowing that there's someone you can turn to and he's here right now to meet that need in your life the word of God says where two or three where two or three are gathered together in my name there am I in the midst of them so we know that he never lies the Bible says that it's impossible for him to tell a lie and we know that he keeps his word he's here right now to meet that need in your life one hundred and twenty were gathered in one place, not sure what would happen, but trusting in God's grace till they got down to praying in blessed one accord. Wind and fire that filled that house was the presence of the Lord. And he's here right now. Yes, he is. Here right now. We don't need to wait. We don't need to
Give Jesus a hand. Glory to God. <laughs> Glory to Jesus. Praise him. He's the reason we're here. Oh, Glory to God. Praise God. You know what? I'm going to show you how we praise the Lord in our church. You know, you can just pretend you're over across the track where I live, and we just get down. You know, we didn't have song books and all that. We just happened to know the song. You can sit down, but you're probably going to be getting up. Anyway. Here we go. We're going to do it like we do it in our church now.
you know, because you're such a great audience, I think we should do one of our hits for you. I know you've been sitting there all night, and here they're going to do one of their hits. And here we're going to do it right now. Set it up. Anybody got any sunglasses here? Wait, here's a. I didn't think it have any here, but here's, here's a guy over here. Where? Sir. Yes, sir. Could I borrow? It? Oh, yeah. Yeah. Right. Thank you, brother. My favorite color too, red. <laughs> Okay, give me the key. Uh, close enough.
Here's one you can sing along with us. Huh? chapter the seventh verse is Jesus himself speaking and he said this he said if you abide in me and my words abide in you ye shall ask what you will and it shall be done unto you I like that that's his promise to us for those of us who've invited him in and someone told me in the Greek that means that I command you to command me whatsoever you will 
and it shall be created for you. That's just how much he cares about each one of us. He wants the very best for our lives. And I want to teach that little chorus to you. When Satan tells you you can't make it, you can just agree with what the word of God says. And Jesus said this. If you abide in me, and my words abide in you, ask what you will, it shall be done unto you. You sing it with us. If you abide in me, and my words abide in you, ask what you will, it shall be done unto you. He said this. In that day, talking about today, ye shall ask me nothing. I say unto you, whatsoever you shall ask, the Father in my name, he will give to you. The King James Version says, Hitherto have you asked until this, nothing in my name. Ask, you shall be.